What's up guys? Welcome to the channel. We're gonna hop into Day Island in just a second. We'll be running a pretty unkitted scar. Um, but yeah, let's check on the bank. We are at just a little bit shy of 1.8 million. So money's starting to roll in. We're feeling pretty good. We finally got past that 1.3 million hump that we were stuck at for a pretty long time. But yeah, let's hop in. Who knows? Maybe we'll make it to 2 million today. <laughs> All right, I'll see you in there. All right, here we go. So I tried to abort that search really quick. There we go. Um, because I had not finished packing my bag. Unless I'm shooting that's close. Um, but yeah, then the count, I hit the abort button and then the countdown started anyway. But it's all right, we got in, we grabbed some peaches and we grabbed a syringe, so we are set. But yeah, I don't really have much of a plan for today. I guess I never really have much of a plan. Sounds like some really far shooting. I don't. I don't expect that shooting to even make it <laughs> into the recording, because uh, I can barely hear it in game. All right, so I think there's someone in Gore Pit based on that shot just now. So we might be able to. No, we don't want that stuff. Oh yeah, there he is. He's on the tower. All right, we got one hit on him. Let's keep going. Maybe that will scare him. Maybe that will scare him and he won't come after us. All right. What do we got? Oh, okay. Not a bad start. Now I definitely don't want him to stay alive. <laughs> I don't see him anymore, but I'm pretty sure he's still alive. I'm like... <laughs> Okay, yeah, I think we should take- I think our plan should be to take him out, actually. And then try to run towards Gore Pit to get out of here. Um, so if we kill him now... Oh my god, did he just- Oh my gosh, did he jump? <laughs> I don't know why I was so concerned about that, it's just a video game, but... That really concerned me. But, that doesn't necessarily mean he's dead. So, I gotta play this a little carefully. I don't know, should we go check it out? Uh, I don't know. Uh oh. That's not a good sign. <laughs> uh, that fence door was not open when we came in. So, that means that we have. We got someone else nearby could be in this very building right now. Hmm. Alright, yeah, I do not like this at all. I think our plan is going to be to just try to make a run towards the hills. I don't even know where that came from. think it was behind us but yeah we're gonna just run for the hills here <laughs> I think that will be our best bet because uh, we don't know if the gore pit died and we think there's someone at squeaky gore pit's not dead This guy's unkillable. <laughs> Maybe we should just leave him. Maybe it's not meant to be. Alright, there's gotta be someone else around here too. Whoa. 
That was close. Ooh, that was a bad timing there. Good thing he's far away. Alright. I think we're good now. Man, that scared me. I... <laughs> Oh, all right, let's go. I think we should be a little safer. Yeah, we don't need that mag. Uh, and I gotta check something real quick, so I'm gonna hop in this tree and tab out for a second. All right, we're back. We did forget something. We forgot to put the heart rate on, but it's good. We're, we're set now. And then we just heard another shot, actually, right when I tabbed back in. Oh, we got another guy. Huh. I can't tell if he's staring at us or not. I don't think he's going to see us on this hill. So I think we're going to get a little closer. Uh-oh, he moved. That's not good. All right, well, hopefully we beat him to the top of this hill. I'm a little nervous now. All right, there we go. Ooh, he came around kind of quick. But we got him. We got him. We're safe. Okay, I feel like when I start this game and <laughs> I play my first raid on prison, I always expect it to be, like, kind of relaxed and stuff. And then it gets like, I don't, I don't know, maybe this is, I don't think this is relaxed. I think it's fair to say this is not relaxed. This is, an, this is kind of an intense start. Just like all these people running up at the, running up the hills at us and stuff. And uh, if you've watched me before, you know I just like, I hate, <laughs> I hate fighting on these hills. I like being on the hill, I guess, but I hate, uh, fighting people on the hill just because there's like you can't really plan for where they're going to come from like that guy he could have approached at like any part of the hill he could have showed up so he could have been on my left he could be on my right and you don't know and that makes me really uncomfortable so I kind of hate the hills it's not really how I want to start my match but it's okay it gets us in we're warmed up now probably we've killed a quarter of the server so I think we should be pretty safe to get out. Like, I don't, <laughs> there shouldn't be anyone else coming into prison anytime soon. Cause, uh, I actually don't even know where that last guy we just got. I don't know where he would come from. I guess he could be... Alright, we did that. My only guess is, like, so we spawned, like, right here, right? And I would guess that guy might have spawned either, like, in the hills or by the ambulance. That kind of area. I think normally those people, <laughs> those people, people that spawn in those, like, in that ambulance area, I feel like they normally go into research. But, you know, every now and then they show up at prison and they scare you on the hill. It's alright, we won. We gotta, you gotta earn your GPUs sometimes. You can't always easily escape with them. Let's see, maybe we'll get an NRS here. I'm not as, like, <laughs> I know a couple days ago I was like, oh man, I, I'm so scared, I hate this part. Um, I know the, the other day I was complaining, not complaining, but just <laughs> mentioning how I have no NRSs and stuff, but I'm good now. I, I got a couple farms, rotations in, harvested a couple crops and stuff, so I should be pretty good on NRSs. I think my biggest issue was... I wasn't finding players that had them. Uh, and then more recently, I've started to see some players with NRSs and stuff. So it's not as bad. The drought, the NRS drought is is going away. We're, we're doing better on NRSs, but I'm still only bringing like one in. But, you know, maybe, maybe I'll get fancy. Maybe I'll bring a second NRS in soon. Who knows? Uh, but that's actually another reason why I don't go on Matka or Underground as often. I just feel like it's, <laughs> I'm sure it's not, but I just feel like it's a hard map to play unless you bring in like two or three NRSs and, and like a decent armor set because uh, the bots, there's just so many of them. 
and they're very hard to avoid and then they just end up taking chunks out of you every now and then. Right, that one's a bot down on the road. Um, yeah, let's keep moving, I guess. Alright, that's pretty close. Um, that sounds like someone is actually right down here on this road. So let's check it out. Uh, maybe not. I actually can see someone right there on the roof. I don't think that's who is taking a shot. <laughs> Man, my aim is not too great today, huh? So I think there might be two people in that corner. How are we doing on ammo? Two takes left here. Oh no, I'm kind of going against my rules here. I should probably just get out. Yeah, let's just get out. We made sure to let them know that we're here, so uh, they can come find us now. <laughs> and we probably waited a little too long, actually, so... If they wanted to get here, they would, uh, they would have had the time to get to us. <laughs> so not my smartest play, but let's see. Maybe we'll still make it out. Maybe we'll be all right. Maybe we scared them. I don't think we scared them. Ooh. Oh, wait. That, like, didn't even hurt us. <laughs> oh, man. He's still going after us. Gotta do our evasive maneuvers here. Left, right, left, right, jump. Alright, let's see what we want to do here. Um, I feel like he's definitely going to come after us. But I think if we're quick, I think we can just get out. I don't think we need to fight this guy. We have a, I would fight him if we didn't have the GPU. I promise. We got the GPU. Let's just get out. We don't want to lose this. And based on where he was shooting from, I don't think he can get to us in time. Um, as long as we don't loot. See, a lot of people will make that mistake, too. They'll come here. Uh, well, I guess it's not a mistake, because you don't know that you're being hunted. <laughs> but you don't want to spend too much time at this exfil. It's not, well, not worth it. If you have good stuff, just get out. There's good stuff here too, but it's just not worth sticking around. Um, and if you spend too much time here, someone will eventually sneak up on you and take all your stuff. All right, so just the three kills. Not not great aiming either, but pretty good start. Um, yeah, let's get this let's get this uh, hooked up, and I will see you guys in the next one. All right, here we go. I haven't had this spawn in a while, but this is fun. I was actually thinking of switching out to the Tapco as well, but then I forgot. And I was too lazy to <laughs> redo all my ammo vests and stuff, so we're going to keep playing with the SCAR for now. Um, alright. So, since we're doing pretty decent on money, I'm not as concerned with looting right now. Uh, I'll take some fun items and some good expensive ones like silencers and sights still. But I think we don't need to loot every little thing. I think we're going to try to do some more PvP today. Maybe. <laughs> I say that, but like, Tabor has a way of like, making plans and then the plans change. Um, Alright, so we're keeping an eye on the right side. Actually, and the left side. Because <laughs> there are two spawns near us here. But I think we're alone. Um... Sometimes you'll see them running up the hill from here to Lighthouse. Uh, and that's always a fun, a fun shot to take. But yeah, I don't see anything here, so we're going to just keep moving forward. There we 
Mako. Uh, I like to, if I can, kill them in one shot. Um, but one, it's just nicer to save bullets and stuff. Um, but two, the bigger reason is I think it's kind of hard to track someone, like where the shot came from, if you only hear one shot. Once you get to the two or three shots, like, two's, two's fine too. It's pretty hard to track two shots. But once you get into the three, that gives people enough time to, like, turn and face the direction that they think the shot's coming from, and then they hear the third shot, uh, and then they can kind of know, get a, a pretty good picture of where you're shooting from. So, always try to just do that one shot. And if you have to take more than one shot, just be a little cautious about it. Just know that someone might know where you are now. Man, we're still, uh... Still alone, huh? There's gotta be someone up here, though. Like, 99% of the time, you're not the first person into radio. So, let's see. Ooh, that was good. That was lucky that we turned around right then. What was he running? Nice M4. Alright, we'll, we'll come back for that. Uh, we'll probably end up taking that gum. But... I don't want to. I don't want to be looting on the hill right now. So I, I feel like there's probably someone still in this building. We just haven't seen them yet, and they could pop up and surprise us on that hill at any time. All right. Is that two or three? What? I'm getting both. Yeah, let's go check this out. I'm getting twos and I'm getting three ticks. So that's cool. Oh man, I do not want to go check that guy's stuff. <laughs> we might leave that one there. I, I've had some bad experiences um, on that like edge. I don't like going there. Actually, yeah, like let's go in. Let's go in. Uh, like just recently, I was playing. I didn't record this night because I was just uh, I wasn't feeling very chatty, so I just wanted to relax and. Uh, play some games without talking all the time um but anyway i was playing i went up onto that roof to try to look over oh, so far so good uh look over the edge to see if anyone was like coming through into this entrance of research or whatever and right when i did that well, we could have a guy here so i gotta focus uh yeah right when i did that looking looking over the edge i got a lag spike and yeah, there has been someone here they were kind of What is going on? Where are all these people coming from? All right, we gotta move. I think there's still someone in this building too. Oh my god! Uh, that's that was unfortunate. Good timing right there. I think there's someone in this building. Yeah, he's right there. Ah oh, man, we should have had him though. Well, how did we not kill that guy too? He, we didn't trade or anything. That's weird. Ah, uh, bummer. All right. Um. Yeah, let's go back in now. I guess we can switch to the Tapco. Uh, but yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. Oh, all right, we got the long run here. Let's go. So I switched out for the Tapco. Um, pretty disappointed that we did kill that guy. Like, <laughs> but that's just how it goes. He got a nice headshot on us. But I felt like we fired enough bullets to at least trade. But oh well. The boar said no. The boar said no today. No trades. Um. Oh yeah, I should put a second pouch. I'm hoping to find a pouch. I like to have two. So the problem with these drum mags is you can't hot swap them or whatever, palm the mags. So I keep an empty pouch on my vest, and then when I need to switch it, I have that empty pouch to use, basically. If you're wondering why I have an empty pouch, and I do have a, I have a spare mag in my bag, but we really shouldn't, shouldn't need it. So here we go. So, 
it's nice and quiet so far, but it won't be for in a second. I know there's people here. There's always people here, man. I think that's a bot? Let's see, that should be a bot. Yeah, let's just wait here for a second and let him uh, yeah, finish his patrol. Because actually, there's no point in shooting him. Okay, well, he shot us, that was kind of rude. But yeah, we're gonna still keep him alive. Alright, so not finding what we want here. That's okay. We're gonna keep moving. I don't know why they spawn empty water bottles. <laughs> like, I feel like there should at least be a minimum. Is that a shot? Can't tell if I just heard a shot or not, like hitting the building wall. I think there's someone in here. Oh. Yeah, I thought I heard something, like, besides the bot's footsteps. I guess that's a reason why you'd want to kill the bots sometimes. It can be a little hard now to tell. Like, I think that's still the bot. Yeah. All right, let's keep going. Um, the thing that gave it away for me there was there was a a moment where they hit their gun on the wall or something. Like, it made that clack sound. And uh, guards can't do that. <laughs> guards can't make a clacking sound. So we knew there was a person with us. Another giveaway. So, like, I didn't know this stuff for a while. Since I play solo, you can't really tell. Um, racking your gun, swapping the mag, uh, that stuff all makes sound for other players. Hitting your gun against a wall. Oh, that was kind of scary. Uh, hitting your gun against a wall will make sound as well. So just keep that in mind. Uh, shooting, that makes sound too. So. Your watch though does not. You can you can beep your watch all you want. No one no one else can hear that. But pretty much everything else they can hear. Also, like I don't know if you guys have noticed this, but like eating is incredibly loud. Like eating and drinking is super loud. Uh, so is like getting exhausted. That one's really loud. And um, yeah, I forget. There's one other surprisingly loud sound effect, but I, I can't remember it now. Someone was here, and I don't think it was the guy that we met in prison. So my thought process then is this person probably went into research. And I don't know. I don't know if I feel like going into research just yet. I might go sit up in this tree, uh, just like get a bearing for the surroundings and regain the stamina that we need. And then I think I'm going to sprint up to radio and then maybe circle back down to uh, the research after that. Alright, so, so far so good. Nice and clear here. And our stamina is pretty low, so I think we should probably wait here a bit. Oh yeah, always check up there too. <laughs> There's like, people love this hill, so don't come hide in this tree. And forget to check that hill, because they could be right next to you. Um, but yeah, there's going to be a lot of people still in this game. We only saw one guy. But well, we know there's at least one other person, too. Alright, we're almost back. I want to give things like one more look, and then we'll go. 
checking the trees behind us as well. Don't want any surprises there. And then always check the roof line. There's always people running around the roof line when you're not looking. Alright, here we go. I think we'll check for the GPU. Okay, hold on. There's a guy coming down the hill right now. Thought I didn't want him to see us. But we should be able to uh, get him right here when he comes up. I think we want to stay a little. Ah. Uh. We didn't get him. <laughs> Dang. Hmm. So there goes our surprise. I don't think he knows where we are, though. But let's just check for the GPU. Alright, no luck there. Hmm, how to play this. Do you think he's gonna come straight at us? I wouldn't expect him to. But I think going up that staircase right now would be a dumb plan. So maybe we can get an angle if we get a little closer. I think I just heard his gun click on something. We're gonna move. I I don't know where he is. And I think we should move. Alright, so we're gonna do exactly what we said we were not gonna do. <laughs> That's what I was saying. Tabor has a way of changing your plans for you. Let's go up one more floor. Seeing him still. Maybe he'll just go into the garage. Like, I'm really hoping he just keeps running in. But, not optimistic that he will. Seems like he might be a. Uh, Playing this one a little safe, which is smart. Because, like, honestly, he probably has no idea where we are. Especially now. But also, we have no idea where he is, so... We should probably not stay in one place for too long. Let's keep going. Alright, so the conference room is definitely looted. I'm not, like, super eager to run in there. This is how I lie. I can't go up here anymore. This is how I died in this one game. I jumped on this kind of little tarp, tried to move forward a little bit. Right at that moment, I lagged out, and then it didn't read my stop moving command because that part didn't get... Uh, that was the part where I was lagging out when I tried to stop moving, and then I just kept walking to my death. So now I don't really like going on those tarps either. That was close. But not that close. <laughs> not like close enough for me to actually tell where that came from. I'm guessing we had our roof guy and he probably dropped into the loot room. And then from there, I have, I have no idea where he would have gone from there.
Hmm. Yeah, I really don't know how to play this one. Bummer. I guess we can uh, drop down and see if we can find that guy. But like, he's gonna be long gone by now. Probably like I probably swapped places with him. Like he's probably in our spot now, and we're in his spot. I think let's get up. Let's get up the hill. We got a ranged gun, so let's play to our advantages here. Though I mean, I trust I trust the Tapco in close range too, but not if I don't have to. <laughs> So I was hearing shooting and bombs and stuff going off. So there's definitely someone still in there. But unless they show up in like one of these windows soon, we don't have much chance of getting them. So I might just keep moving. So that was probably a respawn guard. I doubt. There's no way people left this untouched. Yeah. There we go. The crate just opened. But who knows? No. Ah. Uh. Okay. So that one was a trade. I, that completely caught me by surprise. Where did that guy even come from? Ugh. All right, let's um, let's try to forget about that one. <laughs> well, we didn't really lose anything good, so um, yeah, I'll get kitted up again, and I'll see you guys in a second. Ah, this is perfect. This is great. I was kind of, I was hoping. I was like, man, I really hope I get a prison spot. And we did. Okay, well. I was hoping it would be a little bit of a more stealthy prison approach spawn, but whatever. No one can be here this quick, so we're good. Well, I guess that's not true. If everyone loaded in at the same time, there's no one going to be here yet. So we can just run up here freely. I don't have a care in the world right now. So, not looking great here. <laughs> it's alright. We already got our GPU for the day, so we're happy. But why be happy with just one GPU when we could be happy with three? That would make us even more happy. Alright, that's a guard down there. All right, let's just make our way to prison uh, to research again. I like checking this this one though. This cell has sometimes some decent stuff. I mean, it's hit or miss like every other box, I guess. But I found silencers in here before. Oh, well, we have to we have to go check that out. like right on this hill somewhere. Hmm. So they might come down and go through squeaky. Or they could drop down and go that way. 
So I think if we stay here, I feel like they're gonna go through Squeaky. But I think this was Gore Pit. Gore Pit rotated over here. That's the bot, I think. Running around through the trees and stuff. Alright, well, I don't like this. I feel like we stayed too long now. Hmm. We saw the guard just now pointing over here. makes me wonder like maybe they're not even coming into prison huh. yeah I have no idea where this guy is now oh it's not a great feeling <laughs> should be fairly safe in this little box though Yeah, I'm like wondering, what was he even shooting at? Oh wait, hold on. I just saw some movement on the hill. I think. <laughs> it also could have been these power lines messing with my perception, but I th think they're up on the hill. So we're gonna go, and I think it was a duo. So we're gonna try to sneak up and see what happens. Watch, it was just like a tree branch though. <laughs> like, there's no one here. I thought I saw two people and it was just like one tree rendering at the distance. I don't know. I don't think trees usually shoot large guns like that, so it might not be a tree, but you never know. Alright, so I think they're on the other side of this hill. I'm hoping they're still there, but like, they've got a decent distance to run and that shot sounded sounded fairly close I think we could catch them here I mean that was a he timed that jump really well <laughs> Alright, this isn't looking good. So now we have no idea where he went. Oh, he's, okay, he's still in front of us, that's good. Got this, guys. Here we go. No. Don't think we got him there. Got any more grenades? Yeah. Oh man, I thought that grenade was good. I think we got him with that grenade. I thought it was a good throw. Dang, nah, this guy crushed us. Dragon off. Ah, oh, man, not my day today. <laughs> All right, um, maybe we'll switch maps. I'm gonna switch up and try one more. So I will see you guys in a second. All right, here we go. Decided to switch it up. Oh, we spawned in Scott's house, cool. Um, and play some Modka, maybe. Maybe Island's just like not really working for us today. That's all right. All right, 
And so my plan here is I want to get right into the museum. Got to be careful because there could be a spawn that would come right there. But it doesn't look like they're in yet, so or they didn't spawn there. So our approach is safe. Let's go. I've seen the collector one time. People are crazy. Um, so I don't have high hopes for finding him again anytime soon. But yeah, we'll see. Maybe we'll get lucky. Keep that shut. I don't really want people to know which path we took here. And there's also a spawn in this building. So even getting here really early like this. Still gotta be careful. Alright, so no collector. And it doesn't look like we have the item we want either. I was looking for that um purple card. Now I'm just listening for footsteps. Sounds like a bot. That's my typical game plan here. I rush to hot spots like static spawns and check for those. And then oh, gotta be a little careful here. Once those are cleared, then I start going after player kills. Uh, since that's what keeps this game fun. For me at least. And um, so I'll basically just be listening for gunshots. And we think we heard some outside. So let's go look. Maybe maybe someone's running Scott. Take a peek. Probably just spend the rest of this raid just running around now on the outside looking for people every time we hear gunshots. We'll, we'll chase that down. Alright, so they're not running Scott. Where should we go next? I haven't seen any open boxes either. But we're bound to run into someone soon. Alright, not that guy though. <laughs> I meant like an actual player. <laughs> oh man, I can't aim today at all. Another trade. Alright, we're gonna do we're gonna do that again. We're not ending on that one. Let's go. Ooh, that almost caught us. This gun was not on full auto. Uh, we picked it off of some person else, someone else who was using it, and they had it on single fire. Um, and that got us killed once in the very beginning of this wipe, so uh, I'm always checking that now. But, yeah, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> Today has not been the best day. It's been a little, a little frustrating. Uh, uh, that's all right. Uh, yeah, that's like camp. Because like, if you have, if you just always win, you never die in this game. It kind of gets boring. So, all right, I'm gonna go in. Oh, he's right there. All right, not too much damage. Let's keep going. Um, those shots sound like ill people. 
Uh, by that I mean I think someone spawned by the ambulance camp. And they were shooting the guard on the road there. So they might come this way and we have to keep an, an ear out for them. But right now they can't be here. They can't get here as quick as us. But we don't want to spend too much time in here because they'll be here soon. I, I think before we can actually check the two statics and leave, I think they could get here. So we'll probably have to deal with them on our departure. People like them yet. We're done. Alright. Especially if we spend time reading notebooks. Let's just stay full health right now. Actually, yeah, we're gonna switch mags right now, too. We don't need to, but I just want to play it a little safer. Alright, so no card. I'll take a pouch, though. And now let's take a peek at the hill. No one coming down the hill. Pretty quiet in here too. I'm starting to think maybe they didn't go into research yet. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not hearing anything. I think I was gonna go to the roof and try to like spot people, but like I don't think we're gonna see anyone. At least not right now. All right, here we go. We'll check GPU spawn. And then I think we'll just uh, head to prison. I don't think anyone came into research, okay. That's cool. Interesting. Oh, that's a nice grip. Let's go. Oh, and we actually were able to use it. That's even better. Or like grab it, I mean. I was playing the other day, not recording, and uh, I was looting this this bin right here, and some guy actually snuck up on me. I don't think they were trying. I think they just ran, and I just couldn't hear them until they were like in the side of the room. Uh, somehow I killed them because I guess they were shooting me with like aerosol pellets out of an Ruger. So I won the fight, but man, that really gave me a that gave me a pretty big scare. They definitely should have should have killed me. I'm gonna make my way over to prison now. Cause I'm kind of intrigued by the fact that no one came into research. I'm sure there's someone over there if we head to radio. I'm pretty sure we'll run into someone too. But I'm feeling prison, let's go. Let's go prison. This is my favorite, favorite little drop approach here. Because no one ever expects it. But yeah, you can safely drop down here, no problem. 
and then you can get a good surprise on people if they're uh, leaving prison right then. Hmm. Still nothing going on. Haven't caught a glimpse of anyone. Didn't see anyone in the warden's office. Weird, weird game so far. I think the only indication we even had was some shooting early in the beginning uh, from that camp. And then since then it's been like dead quiet. <laughs> so we got someone died there. You can see the vest floating in the air. So at least there were people in this game. But we're actually here, I would say, kind of a dangerous time. Like, we're still... We're still early enough that the OG prison crowd, the OG prison spawn people, It'd still be here roaming around. What? Oh man, okay, today has been fairly terrible, <laughs> um, but I gotta end on that one because I gotta go. But thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next one.